How's everyone doing? Welcome back to the Auto Garage YouTube channel. Today's video is gonna be really simple. I just asked my friends, where did your love for cars start and how did you get into cars? For me personally, it was Hot Wheels and Need for Speed Underground on the GameCube. Nobody really got me into cars. I kind of discovered this passion myself through the media I just mentioned. And this passion further increased when I turned 16 and I got my license. My first car was really boring. It was a 2004 Jeep Grand Cherokee, automatic, wasn't even four wheel drive. Not the best first vehicle, but I got rid of that, saved up my money. And last October, I bought a 1996 Mazda MX-5, really fun car. And recently I added to my, I guess, garage, you could say, and got a 2008 Mazda Speed 3. Cars are an amazing passion. The customization is endless. The community is endless. And I could talk about cars all day long. But we don't have time for that because I asked my friends, how did they discover their passion for cars? Let's get into it. Hi, my name's Grayson, and uh, I drive a 1996 GMC Sonoma. Uh, my passion for cars started at a young age. I had a big, like, Rubbermaid tub full of just, like, Matchbox cars that I grew up playing with. And um, early on, like I started watching Top Gear and like I got into cars and, and everything. And my parents would always tell me, you know, that I knew like every car, like we could drive down the road and I can name it, like the make and model. And um, around like 12 or 13, I started to get into the Forza Motorsports game series. And uh, from then my passion just took off. So um, I really enjoy cars. I drive a, a manual transmission, so I just, I love the connection to the road and um, just having that freedom with driving is just really nice. I'm Michael, I drive a 2005 Explorer and it's lifted. Um, I guess what got me into cars was my dad. He always played Need for Speed with me as a kid growing up. Since about, I was probably about five years old. Um, he's owned at least 50 or 60 cars since I've been alive, and it's always just been interesting to me. I've always loved driving in them, riding in them, working on them. It's just something I can spend a lot of time doing, and it always makes me happy. What's up? I'm Sam. Drive a 2018 FK7 Civic Hatch Sport. It's a fucking beautiful car. Love it. So I say my dad, he definitely got me into cars because I would always help him uh, work on his 1987 Porsche 911 Carrera. Uh, beautiful car and then I also watched you know cars all the time I watched that shit religiously along with just like watching a whole bunch of car related YouTube videos um, and I really started getting into cars I'd say the freshman year going into uh, high school my name is Caleb Page I drive a 335 IX it's a six-speed manual it's an E92 and uh, I'd say what really got me into cars was when my brother started looking for his first one he wanted a Jeep and he wanted a stick shift and I really fell off the deep end with it now and uh, I wanted something fast so now I like anything and everything fast as long as it's got three pedals. Hey guys, John. Um, probably the main thing that got me in cars was my dad when I was younger. Uh, he was always a big muscle guy and that kind of changed for me but um, yeah between my dad and my friends uh, that's kind of what kept me interested in cars and being able to you know make a car my own but this is my 1999 miata um haven't been able to do too much to it yet but i have a lot in store for it and we'll see where it takes us well hello auto garage family honored to be on the uh on the channel my name is kevin from exhaust sports auto and how did i get into cars i always had actually like an affinity for cars i always liked cars i always had like those little toy car things and all that good stuff and i got into reviewing cars because well because i was always into cars i'm kind of very disappointed that the reviews are out right now so that's why i started to take car reviewing very seriously and i currently drive a lc 500 lexus Thank you for having me. Please do subscribe to Auto Garage for sure. Ring the bells, do all that good stuff. Thank you again for having me. What's up guys, this is my 2009 Audi A4, lowered on some PSWs, honeycomb grill, race lane coilovers, straight pipe to the muffler. My name's Caden, you can follow me on Instagram at bird underscore B8. And I got the car, I don't live in somewhere where there's a lot of cars around, car scene is not very big, it's growing, but I saw a Porsche one day and I was like, I have to have a German car. And I'm falling in love with it. Love it. I mean, it might be big, but it drives perfectly.
I'm Sigurd Johnson, and I drive a 99 NB Miata. I basically got into cars through a buddy of mine, Charlie. He and I had like nothing really in common. We just skated back in the day, and he, he's been into cars like his entire life. And I remember over a summer one year, he just kept showing me like, you know, like 240s, Zs, stuff at the track, like drifting and stuff. And you know, I thought it was cool or whatever, but he just kept pounding and pounding and pounding it like into my skull that like, hey, drifting is really cool. Cars are really cool. Like, you know, you might want to like look into it or whatever. And now I'm here. Hey, what's up? My name's Abram. I have a 1994 Mazda Miata. And this is my current daily. As far as uh, cars go, what really got me into cars is my previous car was a uh, 89 CRX SI and a lot of my buddies from where I'm from, uh, South Jersey, we would just go on weekends, drive around, uh, it's very flat there so we used to just have fun driving around, ripping through the streets and just kind of modding our cars because especially with Hondas and I mean even with Mazdas, everything's uh, pretty cheap as far as bolt-ons and everything like that. But um, from that, my love of just working with my hands. I'm actually in school finishing up to be a aircraft technician and again just getting to work with larger reciprocating engines and turbine engines. It's just a lot of fun and um, hanging out with Miata guys is a lot of fun as well. What's up Auto Garage? My buddy Michael asked me to tell him why I got in the cars and what I'm driving. Well this is my Miata right here. It's a 2006 Mazda Miata MX-5 Club Spec. And the reason I got in the cars was honestly rally. I was watching point A to point B rally, I was watching VWs, Volkswagens, Hondas, Miatas, anything you could, the different levels, all the way from pro level to the basic level, so yeah, race cars and Miatas. My name's Nate, this is my 05 TSX, and the main reason that I got into cars was my family, I mean my grandpa was super into classic cars, my dad's into classic cars, and also I just have a natural interest for how things work and how things go together, and cars is the perfect hobby for that, always taking things apart. My name is Alex. I drive a 79 Dodge D150 and a 1991 Mazda Miata. I got into cars because of my daddy taking me to shows and we'd get Hot Wheels. So how I got into cars, this is an interesting one. I've always kind of been interested in anything with wheels. Um, but, you know, when you're a kid, you know, you don't really have too, too much access to, like, road cars, I guess. Um... But I guess I think the moment that really got me into cars was um, my neighbor, Adam, who's one of my good friends. Um, one of his buddies came home with a WRX STI, and I was like, man, this thing is sweet. And so I, you know, I started hanging out with those guys, and now I'm here with a Miata. So, yeah, just kind of went that. What's popping, y'all? I got asked to do a guest interview about cars and how I got involved in cars by Michael Cohen on Auto Garage. Check him out and subscribe. Um, I got introduced to cars when I was 12 years old and I saw my uh, grandfather's 1962 Mustang Corvette. Corvette, in that. But um, that and then I didn't really like that cars as much. And then I got my first car in TSX when I was 16 years old. And then one of my good friends, Michael Cohen, Auto Garage, subscribe. Um, he introduced me to cars and told me more about them and everything, and I was like, you know, this is kind of cool. So then I bought the uh, 2000 BMW Z3 Roadster. I love the thing. Um, I love cars now. My next car I'm going to get is going to be uh, uh, hopefully a truck, maybe. Um, might get a motorcycle. Might get a, um, who knows, maybe I'll get a Lamborghini. I don't know. That's all I'm going to have to talk to y'all. So subscribe to Auto Garage. Subscribe to Auto Buckets. I'll see y'all later. Hi, I'm Parker Blaine too. This is my 2012 Vector TL. Um, so I forgot what I'm saying. Thank you so much for sticking to the end of the video. I hope that means that you enjoyed it. And if you did enjoy it, please like and please subscribe. I'm trying to get to my 1,000 sub goal by the end of the year. And you subscribing helps me out a ton. But I believe my, I guess you could say, hypothesis was right. I thought most people would get into cars either through video games and toys or through their parents. And most people, it does seem that that was the case. And I found it pretty interesting. So comment how you got into cars down below. I'm curious to know. My name is Michael. This is Auto Garage. Thank you so much for watching.